in a little town called Elyria, Ohio, right? 114900 right? And we would need to rent this thing for $1,149 a month for it to hit the 1% roll. <laughs> Government guaranteed rent, y'all. That is the name of the game. Okay, the last thing we're gonna look at is the uh, inside of the garage. Okay, folks, Cleveland's lead certification problem or program, I mean, we should call it a problem. Typically, right, if we're comparing Elyria to Cleveland, I love Elyria uh, for several reasons. And it's not just the fact that the prices are a little bit lower. How about the fact that it is way more landlord friendly? Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sales Show. Folks, they can sell it at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch TV, giving it to you straight. The 1% rule in 2023, is that still a thing? Are there markets where people are still hitting it, even surpassing it in 2023, folks? Yeah. It don't happen often, okay? It ain't freaking, it, it ain't even 2020, right? They, I mean, you know, 2020, we were doing a little bit more. 2023, we ain't really doing it. Uh, like, you know, for like a good decade, right? 20, no, even more, like 2009, all the way up to like 2019 into 2020, right? We were able to hit it. And then like once towards the, the end of 2020 came, like we were just pretty much cruising with uh, increased prices and we really weren't able to get that 1% rule anymore. Don't get me wrong though. Rents have kept up and rents have been going way up, but in 2023, it's hard. It's hard to find markets, places where you can still invest in a property hitting the 1% rule. But luckily for you guys, I got one today. 1040 West River Road in a little town called Elyria, Ohio, right? 114900 right? And we would need to rent this thing for $1,000. $149 a month for it to hit the 1% roll. Not very many markets uh, are you able to do that. But guess what? Uh, we're doing a little bit better, doing even better for you because of the amazingness this is, that is Section 8, right? We are currently bringing in $1,370 a month out of this thing, right? Government guaranteed rent, y'all. That is the name of the game. Places like Elyria, Ohio are nice, landlord-friendly little cities in Ohio that a lot of people from around the world don't know about, right? It's like a half hour west of Cleveland. I know a lot of y'all, when you guys think about cash flow investing, turnkey investing, investing in properties, finding markets where you can achieve and even surpass the 1% rule, I know y'all thinking about places like Cincinnati, Ohio, Cleveland, Ohio, Toledo, Ohio, right? But in those bigger cities, folks, and Holton Wise, we operate in all of them, in those bigger cities, you just go outside of them a little bit. There's suburbs and stuff where you can sometimes find even better deals, even better deals like this one, right? Specifically, right, if we're comparing Elyria to Cleveland, I love Elyria uh, for several reasons. And it's not just the fact that the prices are a little bit lower. How about the fact that it is way more landlord friendly, right? The city of Cleveland uh, is a nice little blue dot in a sea of Ohio red, if you know what I'm saying, right? Uh, Elyria, much more landlord-friendly than Cleveland. Another thing, too, is Elyria does not have these new lead paint regulations that the city of Cleveland does. And, man, those lead paint regulations are really throwing Cleveland landlords for a loop, right? So you scoop on over, cruise on over, I guess I should say, not scoop on, cruise on over uh, about a half hour west, and you get yourself the same level of rental demand. You get properties for even cheaper. You get a more landlord-friendly government, and you don't have to worry about some new poorly ran lead paint certification program that is really just uh, an additional tax on landlords. I mean, let's call it what it is, folks. Cleveland's lead certification problem or a program, I mean, we should call it a problem, uh, their program, uh, you know, it doesn't have uh, 
the majority of houses in Cleveland uh, need to, to get certified. It's only the ones that are owned by landlords. Well, I guess it's probably, I don't know the exact ratio, but yeah, I guess in a lot of parts of Cleveland, there's probably 50-50 or more landlords than owner-occupants. But the name of the, the moral of the story is they're not like targeting every single property. They're, they're only specifically trying to target landlords, right? So it's really just a tax on landlords that Cleveland is doing, right? And you get to avoid all that by investing in Elyria. So I really, really do dig this area. Uh, this property... It's a 4-2, right, which is what helps increase the rent. The bigger bedroom counts are going to attract tenants who have bigger bedroom vouchers. And then Section 8 pays more rent to people like you. And that's why we are able to surpass the 1% rule with this bad boy. And uh, as far as the major mechanicals on this, they're all fairly uh, new, right? We got a hot water tank, three to five years old. Those last about 15 years. Okay, roof's about halfway. Oh, uh, no, the furnace, rather. Sorry, the furnace is about halfway through. Uh, it's uh, life expectancy. Those last about 30 years. This one's at about 15. If you had to replace that, probably about 35 hundo. And then the roof is in the first third of its life expectancy because those last about 30 years. And a property like this, you're looking at maybe like seven, eight thousand dollars for that roof, right? So the big ticket items, mechanicals taken care of. Already got a tenant in there. Section eight, rocking and rolling, government guaranteed rent. Only thing to do now is submit your offers to my team. Send them to my team at sales at holtonwise.com. If you want to pay cash, that's fine. Send me an email. Hey, Jay Wise, saw the video. I want to buy 1040 West River. I want to pay 115K cash. Here's my proof of funds. Or, hey, Jay Wise, saw the video. 1040 West River. I want to pay 115K finance. Here's my pre approval letter. Or, guess what? Hey, Jay Wise, I want to buy West River, but I don't have a lender. Can you hook me up with one? And then I'll give you a lender, and then you could send me your pre approval letter with said lender. Let's go. <laughs> The kids. Alright. I'm going to take Jimmy back there by the other room right there. Yeah. I think we just film yeah. the walk out and then yep. we might be able to just do one take walking out. Oh, yeah, we can just go right out there. Get the uh, kitchen from this angle. Okay, last thing we're going to look at is the uh, inside of the garage. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll all exterior for now. Okay. So go to the garage. Okay. Nah, let me get it. Yeah. Alright, okay. Yeah. okay.
Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.